14,000 fentanyl pills and 10 pounds of heroin now in the hands of the Oklahoma Bureau of Narcotics. Investigators say it was all smuggled into Oklahoma from Mexico. News Force Hunter Elise is looking into the results of this months long investigation. Hunter. Kevin and Heather, the Oklahoma Bureau of Narcotics says the investigation took 16 months and included undercover purchases to track down the organization involved. To be effective in these in these type of things, you really have to dismantle the organization all the way back to Mexico. So that's why this took so long as we're really trying to dismantle the organization. So there's no remnants of that organization left behind. Just over a year to uncover this more than 10 pounds of heroin and over 14,000 fentanyl pills. OBN says they went undercover to identify who was involved in smuggling the drugs to Oklahoma. We had approximately 27 arrests out of this case over this last 16 months. Local organizations like the Oklahoma County Sheriff's Office and Jones Police also helped through their new Opioid Crisis Task Force. This investigation took 16 months, but OBN says they're constantly working to get deadly drugs off the street. This is very common, and we do we do these operations daily. We're, we're any given day, we may have 15, 20 operations going on all across the state. While fentanyl and heroin were uncovered in the investigation, OBN says that's not all. Xylazine has been found in drugs in this specific case. Xylazine, a drug the OBN says is meant to sedate animals and can cause damage to the central nervous system in humans. It can be mixed with other drugs. This is the deadliest epidemic we've ever seen. So from August of 2020, to August of 2021, we've seen over 107,000 fatal drug overdoses. OBN says 99% of the drugs on the black market right now are more than likely going to be laced with fentanyl.